So, we have Nurse Scarlett that will give Atai's medicine. Guys, we have here the, the smallest buko. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much guys for coming! Hello beautiful people! Good afternoon! We are finally home. Papa is finally home guys. So we're gonna get him settled here. Um, hello! Say hi to the vlog! Hi guys! Brownie! Say hi to the vlog Brownie! Brownie! Say hi to the vlog! <laughs> say hi to the vlog! Hi! It's lunch! Lunch! Oh my gosh! It's lunch! It's 5 p.m. Um, where's Tony? Tony! Aham, <laughs> siya! So, um, if you guys can recall, in the last video, oh my gosh, there's a kite. The last video, I've shared with you guys that we are going to extend Papa's bedroom with a small balcony in front. We already got the materials. I'm going to give you guys an update on that tomorrow. Today's video is going to be about settling down here. So in the meantime, while well, they are going to be working in Papa's extension balcony, um, Papa is going to be staying here in the second bedroom. I know he doesn't want to because it's hot. It's pretty hot here um, in my house, actually. So, um, he doesn't have a choice because he cannot really stay there. It's very hot. At the same time, he doesn't have a place to like chill and unwind and all that. So, yeah. Um, Papa is changing. He went to his room, changing some clothes. And then, um, yeah, he should be here in the second bedroom. We are going to clean the second bedroom, guys. <laughs> um, because it has all of my stuff in there. But, yeah. Oh! So, we have Nurse Scarlett that will give th her Tatai's medicine. Level prompt. Wow, very good. Oh, good girl.
Okay guys, so Papa is now getting settled here in the second bedroom. This is how it looks. Okay, so we have here the electric fan because it can get very hot here. Then, ta-da! Kira ka diha? Kira ka pa? And then, we have here all of he, um, his need stuff. We have here the water. Here, we have biscuit. We have um, bread right here. All his medicines in this box. This box, he got his cell phone. Okay. Electric fan on. Okay na kadiha? Good night. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> okay. Alright, this has been a long day. Successful, guys, actually, that Papa is finally home. I'm so happy we're finally home. We're not in the hospital anymore because it's so exhausting. Like right now, it's only 7 p.m., but I'm so exhausted. Sis is exhausted. I don't know. The hospital, it's not for me. Okay. Anyway, good night. Pagmon ko so Okay. Papa is there. Alright guys, so I'm going to see you guys tomorrow because I'm pretty tired right now. Hello beautiful people, good morning. This is the next day. We are finally at home. So happy. We have here some visitors. Papa's niece, one and two. And Apo over there. Hello, they're visiting Papa. Saying how he is. Pangga, say hi to the vlog. I guess the vlog. Oh, say hi to the vlog. <laughs> She's shy. Okay, Papa is now eating breakfast, guys. So we have rice and scrambled egg with no salt. Okay, so that's his meal for now. He's feeling a lot better. Like he can walk properly now. Feeling good. Nakatogo kagtaro. Wala. Ano man? Limuot man. Limuot May pa di ko nga na katre. Di mo kana tug. Marita ko sa tungkuan. Dire? Oh my gosh. Okay, so Papa could not sleep well because he said it's too hot in the second bedroom. So yeah, that's why he is um, here for now in the house because we are still trying to um, work on the balcony that I'm extending in the front of, of his room. So I think they're gonna work on it today, my uncle and Atan. Um, in my sister's house, it's actually better because the wind is there because it's a bit higher than mine. So yeah, that's why I always have air conditioned because it's really hot. My, like, our house here, it's like it really gets hot. I think because there is no window in the second bedroom. I mean, there is one, but it's not in the area where the air is blowing. So yeah, what a gloomy day. I think there, we have a low pressure coming in. I'm in the Philippines again, guys. I, I'm actually not feeling well today. I feel a bit weak. Okay, we're gonna have breakfast. This is cooking. They actually like slept in my bedroom last night with Scarlett.
Alright guys, hello! I'm in my pajama because we're just gonna be driving here in the countryside. I am teaching Atan, my brother-in-law, um, to drive this. He actually knows, we just need a refresher. Papa's there. Okay, we're just gonna go to the plaza. I'm just gonna teach him the, like, the stuff that I know. <laughs> I'm definitely not the best teacher, okay? Um, but we have to do this because um, I want him to be Papa's driver if Papa needs to be in the hospital because I might not be around or, you know, at least there is someone aside from me. Okay, we're gonna here. We're gonna be here in the plaza to teach Atan. He is actually able to drive a dump truck and a backhoe I don't know what is that in English like a truck but mine is automatic so we just teach him okay all right guys we're starting our lesson we started our lesson already now it's time for a review oh sige nakapark na no okay park then handbrake oh sige turn on the light ko no Okay, lights on. Long light. Okay, off. Ah, uh, off. Sige mana. Wiper ko no. Oh, sige. Yeah, wipe. Pas pas na wipe. Dili, pas pas. So pa na. Dili, pa down. Ah. Oh. Uh. Okay, off. Okay. Beep ko no. Beep. Okay. Ah. Uh. Dayon. Mana tu no? Gi ama bintana daw. Mama bintana. Nak ke tu no? Oh, dari buka usah. Hmm, oh, automatic nana. Gi. Pikas. Gi. Kena. Oh, mana? Sigi. Ilak ko no, ilak. Lak. Betul. Ilak ang sekianan. Ilak. Kena, kena, kena mana? Kena okay, lak. Oh. Gi unlock. Hmm. Oh. Gi hazard. Uh, get off uh, Aircon Kari? Okay, Dili <laughs> Kari <laughs> <laughs> Get on <laughs> Get on Ay ka look Okay naman na siya uh, Kato Ang kabog na mon Kato siya Oh uh, Kana Mone siya ang kani mm -hmm. So meaning wala na siya kabog na mon Sa arig ka anak Oh uh, Okay mo Get mana Sige toyok ta Get toyok I off sa daw sa kanan be. Off. Oh. Ge okay, okay ra. Ge, okay. ko ajud, ko ang susi, i on. Ge on. Tagal no. Ge, iko an gyud. Di ke baka bakilid man ta. Oh. Ah, ge. Sige. Ge, handbrake. Nag break na kaha sa TL? Hmm, mm, sige. Kani kuha ni dipa. Dipa. Oh, no. sige. Reverse ta. Di reverse. Okay. Di lubag, right? Lubag jud. Ah. Oh. Sige, ikaw na lang. That's it for today's class. <laughs>
Alright guys, Nurse MJ is on duty again. We're going to check Papa's blood pressure. So we have to keep um, checking Papa's blood pressure guys because it goes up really high sometimes. So this is me doing it now. Be, ato sa pikas kamot ibutang nang kuan. Hmm. He's watching his movies on the cell phone. So, good thing that I actually like bought this this thing because this really helps a lot for Papa. And it's automatic. So all you have to do is to start and it's going to do its job. Relax lang anak. Okay, let's see. So Papa actually took his meds for his high blood pressure. It's amlodipine this time because before he was taking losartan and his BP doesn't go down. So the amlodipine is actually being um, recommended by the doctor. So let's see. Hoy, taas ang salagi. Okay, let's wait. I feel like I want to be a doctor, guys. <laughs> In situations like this, yes, I want to be a doctor, that's for sure. I think Papa is really more relaxed that he's here at home because he can talk to a lot of people. Actually, his uncle, um, a lot of our neighbors went here to check on Papa, talk to him what happened. Papa has been explaining what happened to him, what he's feeling and all that. Some of his nieces and nephews went here as well to check on him. My grandma hasn't come here yet. He, I mean, she actually really cannot walk that far. So maybe I'm going to pick her up and then bring her here. Hello, we're checking oh, Tatay. You want? Oh my gosh, 144 over 104. So ubus ubus na. Because last night it was 150. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, so this is... This is a good progress, but when we left the hospital, Panga, it was 130 and now it's 144. Papa cannot be outside. Just stay here because it's really, really hot. Wow, you as well. Hello, everybody. Good afternoon. I was actually taking a nap and then mom woke me up because some people is looking for me and I'm so shocked. We actually do have some subscribers who visited me here at home, guys. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. They're actually outside right now. It's very hot here inside the house. So, let's go. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi, they're from New Zealand. What's your name again? I'm sorry. Paul. Paul and this is? Jennifer. Jennifer and? <laughs> and the mom. Oh, and then another one here. Hello. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for visiting. So here we are guys in the province as usual. This is what we can offer. Fresh buko. So Atan is cutting the buko for them. It's very hot in the countryside right now. So it's best to have some refreshments. Scarlet is here. Look how hot it is. Oh my goodness. Guys, we have here the the smallest buko. Nawodaw tam isba. Usay di kay sagrabi ka tam isba ten ani ka gamay. Tara ante ah. Mike ayo. First time. First time to, yeah. Hmm. Tam is? Ayo ulo. Oh. Nana ti maato man ang mukuha. Ikaw na siya. You want? May patay na to sa akin. Kaya kung isa ka anak, matanaw ang buto. Matanaw po siya? Nabilin da eh? Lado sa balay. Ah. Masyak po siya siya really. Nayan ko namin silang mild yun siya. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much guys for coming. Thanks for watching the vlogs as well. Okay. Wait. Yes, shut up. Okay, go. Bye bye. Hello, everybody. Thank you so much again to Jennifer, to Paul, and the rest of the family for visiting me here in the countryside, guys. Look, we're drinking buko. 
guys we took picture and i didn't even shower today <laughs> i look so haggard you want some buko panga oh my gosh they said hi to scarlet Oi, na hi thanks for coming wala mo ka ni babay oi oi wala mo ka ni babay nila panga why you did not why you did not stay with us panga are you shy Hello everybody, I'm here in my sister's house because I'm going to be sharing with you what's the plan that we will be having here in front of Papa's bedroom because again, Papa needs to have a bigger space where he can chill and relax and as you know how small Papa's bedroom is, he doesn't really have that much space so I decided for the long term, Papa definitely needs a bigger space so the other day i actually went here i drove here really quick because i had to ask bingo to take care of papa for like five hours so that i can instruct my uncle and we can measure something and then also purchase the requirements i mean the requirements the materials that is needed okay so this is the plan all right if you guys remember this is papa's room right that's very small so what we're going to do is we're going to extend here in front so from this column right here we're gonna extend up until here and it goes all the way there and to that column at the end so it is going to be 10 by 10 feet and this is just gonna be like a balcony terrace area exactly the same as mine in the back of my house so yeah um, uh, this morning they've already delivered some of the materials that is needed by the way so I'm gonna show it to you and actually I don't have the I don't have the prices so I'm just gonna show it to you guys because actually it was mom who I requested to purchase everything since I had to go back to the hospital ASAP because I feel bad for bingo because after work she has to um, take care of Papa for a bit all right so right here if you guys can see this is one mini dump truck of sand um, I think this was 3,000 pesos guys so this is how it is um, we had to put it right here because the truck can no longer go there if you guys can see it's impossible because of all the grass and then we have here 100 pieces of halo block so this is uh, 15 pesos per piece so that's 1500 pesos and then we're gonna go over there actually there's a few people here in mommy's store they're actually doing karaoke and i had to tell them to stop for a bit so that i can vlog this because it's actually very loud all right if you guys can see over here we have two square tube we needed that for the roof and then we have this really big um iron thing this will be used for the column of the extension 
and then we have here small ones and then two by two square tube as well and then we have here the rebar can you guys see this is the rebar guys all right so we have about 15 pieces of rebar because that's actually needed we have there a lot of cement the roof is right here and yeah those are the materials that is needed for um the extension so we are still they're actually gonna be starting the extension guys tomorrow because it's sunday today and it's in our custom here in the philippines when it's sunday people are norm normally not working normally chilling doing some laundry and all that or pretty much relaxing so yeah um they're not starting it today papa is actually not here um in the house he wants to go out so i don't know where is he i told him to not go as far but at least he's like you know breathing fresh air so that's good uh, papa is there <laughs> look at least he's watching basketball guys here in the plaza that we have so papa is here so you guys can see all right so again we are gonna be building a balcony in front of papa's bedroom guys so exactly the same as mine mine is not even finished as you guys can see look you can still see the hollow block hollow block here in the front but that's okay we're gonna do that later on in life <laughs> but for now priority is papa okay so that's pretty much it